Hey guys, what's up? Me the Ho. Um, hope you guys are doing well. Hope me and my voice won't give up. We're gonna have a show tomorrow night with um, Jim Harrell on uh, Paranormal Human Radio, 7 p.m. to 8 Pacific Time, 10 Eastern. So be sure to catch that. And yes, I'm wearing my Disney in. You'll see. Okay, I got one more month left. So we are Disney World. I know. I'd be the first of the family. Done in any world, I'm looking forward to that. Anyway, <laughs> I'll talk about the trip when I come back, and then of course I'll take some film and stuff. And uh, make sure you follow me on Instagram so that way you'll see my videos and pictures and stuff. And uh, I'm also on TikTok, you know, Facebook, Twitter. <coughs> anyway, be sure to bring your questions tomorrow night. There's also live radio chat. Anyway, sorry about the pause. I had to drink some more water. And I, yeah, I'm wearing a jacket because it's quite cold in the morning. I'm not used to being up this early. But uh, I might, today is my outing day. I have to um, go for some blood work, physical therapy shopping <laughs> only one day so that's why I'm up early and um yeah a couple of things I want to share that happened to me recently actually it was about the other day it was past. <laughs> okay first of all I want to talk about this ghost girl okay I call her ghost girl because not only that she appeared in my dreams. Um, just like standing there and it's like it makes me wonder did they actually watch you while you sleep? Now that's creepy. <laughs> and you know I'm also a medium and like I tend to attract spirits, so I'm like I wouldn't be surprised if they do watch me sleep. But anyway, Shortly after that dream, um, she woke me up saying like, you gotta help me. I was like, whoa, holy hell. Um, you might hear it too, I hear. And, um, uh, right, I just got some back and stuff. <laughs> and, um, so you might hear back here in my videos and stuff. I even, at one point, something was, <clears throat> oh, well, I'm going to take some water. <clears throat> something was, like, trying to channel over me, the last week video of podcast. So, and it's when I was solo, and I was doing most of the talking, right? And uh, I caught something trying to channel over me that always freaks me out. Me channeling, I know I can probably do it, but it's just fear faster, always sits in the way. One of these days, I'll probably, I'll try it. I'll try it. Channeling. Channel, channeling is like freaks me out because you have to allow yourself to be used by a spirit or ghost. And it's like, it makes me nervous because it's like partial, I wouldn't want to say possession, but yeah, I think that's what freaks me out the most because it might lead to possession. I don't know. I get over that fear, channeling. <laughs> like, it happens to me a lot. Even in these videos, you might hear something. But at least the slaver. It's a friendly ghost. Right, Slammer? <laughs> but if you move for anything, that's cool. That just means that there's something here. Definitely. Um, another thing happened actually here, about here. I was trying to take a nap on the couch over there. And then, and then I felt something pinched by 
Bring in. Like, hit, literally, hit. I talked about naughty spirits. <laughs> oh, man. But yeah, that's pretty much what happened. I literally felt like pinch me. For the rear end. But, um. You might ask me, isn't that making you scared? I think it's one thing. One thing I'll leave here. It's never ever give in to fear, even though it does startle me time and time. And when these things happen, and half time it's hard to get a video, apparently my duty never knows it's happening to him. But, uh, yeah, you just never know. Fear, because even the fear that gives him the energy to manifest and do stuff in which you don't want. So, don't give in to fear. <laughs> Alright, guys, anything from my video, don't ever give in to fear. Alright, so I hope you guys have a great, safe day. Alright, this is my call out before I lose my voice again. <laughs> Later.